welcome back. I just wanted to talk a little bit about something that I'm going to start collecting. I really love Major League Baseball stadiums. I love to go meet the people, explore, and I've seen that since I've stopped collecting, there's a lot of really neat new stadium cards that has pictures of the actual whole stadium as we go. Uh, I really like studying the stadiums back in the day, playing baseball uh, on PS4, or PS3, PS2, all of that to see what they look like. There's like they're the cathedrals of baseball. I love them. Uh, I noticed they have these new, uh, really cool 150 year celebration, greatest moments cards. I'm looking to get a few of those. Uh, but some of the favorites, of course, was my home stadium of the Royals. This is the older stadium from the 90s with the Jumbotron and the big uh, crown vision, we called it. Um, I really liked the fact that and then I got a closer up one. They can get some of these older ones to remind me what the stadium looked like when I went back in the day. And, of course, this is my new favorite because I take a picture right about here every time I go to the stadium just to see what it looks like. Uh, the, the nice note I love that from the 80s to now they changed the uh, seats from, they were like, orange almost they were just ugh, didn't make any sense for having royals now they're blue so it's uh, i really like those but then when i started collecting again i got a bunch of packs and i found these cards i got a full set of all the ones in series one i thought it was pretty cool that i could take a, just a quick look at the uh the parks and i also like the fact that they have the, the names down here because i don't they get renamed, and I don't remember that type of stuff because I don't, I don't really like that. I, I'm always going to refer to it most of the time as, as Pittsburgh Stadium or the stadium in Pittsburgh, baseball stadium. Um, some of them I like more than others, of course. Um, but it's just a full set of these. Fenway Park, I will make it there one day. I was there last year about this time. Uh, that was cool. Uh, Rogers Center, no uh, no interest to go to this unless it's uh, right before they tear it down. St. Louis, I go every year. It's only about three and a half hours away. Um, and it's a really nice place to watch a game. It's just too bad it's, uh, you know, the Cardinals. Um, Atlanta has a new stadium. I'd like to go see that, of course. This always seems like one of my favorite stadiums. Uh, the Philadelphia Phillies. I've always liked the fact that they how they moved the, the fences in and out right around here to help control the home runs because it was really short when I first started. So that's basically it. It's, uh, I've got all of these so far. I'm going to put them in a special place uh, so I can display them. I've, I've also found some, there's some older ones that are black and white that I don't like too much. But there are also the... Um, what are the evolutions of the stadiums? I'm looking to get a bunch of those. They're kind of like these from, I believe, 2019. So they have the, the, the old park and the new park. So I'm looking forward to, to getting some cards like that and add to my collection of the, the stadiums. Uh, I also noticed that Stadium Club, strangely enough, is uh, has a lot of really cool photos of... The stadiums along with the players, so I've been looking online for some of those. Uh, I found some pretty good cards. I'll, I'll show those with you at a later date. So that's all from this video. Thanks for watching.